Michelle and welcome back to my channel. So today is Sunday and it is currently 7.45 a.m. and we are actually heading down to Chicago's Chinatown to get some breakfast from a bakery that I believe is the best Chinese bakery in Chicago's Chinatown which is called uh, Chu Chuan's Bakery and Dim Sum. So I am very excited for this and we are always looking forward to going there because the food is really good and yes, Mr. Ellen is driving and he's excited too because he likes it too. <laughs> so if he likes it, I like it and it's good. Yes, I promise you. Yeah, so we're gonna get some bakeries, you know, and dim sum and I'm super excited for it. So let's go. Okay, we can eat now. Yes, long awaited <laughs> dim sum. Yes, okay, I'm gonna try What do you want to start with? You want to start with the tang fen. Yes. This I'm is ta chao tang fen. Yes. So, filled with the uh, Chinese barbecued pork. It's that red stuff that you typically see. Mm -hmm. And they also come with the shrimp one. There's a shrimp one, and then there's another type, I think it's beef, What's like marinated beef? beef or something like that. I think like sometimes, that? some places they do have you tiao inside, right? Uh, I, don't, I don't think this place does. Yeah. They have three options, but okay. um, our favorite is with the ta sao inside. Yes. Chang fen is like a, I guess the best way to call it is a rice paper roll. So the skin is made from rice and it's very, very chewy, really good. Next. Next. This is quite good too. This is, I uh, got a lot of nice things built. It's got bamboo shoot and I think water chestnut, some pork. Uh, I guess. Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Sometimes it's oily. Yeah, but today's not too oily. It's okay. Yeah. But it's good. I'm gonna do the uh, shrimp dumplings. Very simple. Mm. Really nice texture. Alright, now I'm gonna eat one of my favorites, which is the zima uh, chiao. <laughs> translates to sesame ball. It's basically a glutinous rice ball filled with red bean paste, covered with sesame seeds, and then deep fried. Mm. Really, really good. It's nice and sweet. You wanna try? Mm -hmm. yeah, take this one. Mm, red bean. Mm, so good. Sometimes if it's not made well, it's like very greasy. This one is not greasy. This one's not greasy, you yeah. know? It's so good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, next is uh, shumai. Is it? Let me try shumai. Oh, this is probably one of my favorite ones. Mm. It's very big. So oh. The nice thing about the ones here is they're very meaty. Here. Yep. So, the reason why we go to Chinatown so early in the morning is because of this tohua. This tofu pudding sells out like two times, the past two times we went there. The two times before remember, this one we went there, they were sold out by the time we got there. Like, yeah, and there was one time you went at 8 and it was almost sold out. I got the last two. <laughs> so today we yeah. went earlier and after we went there, more customers came. Yeah. So. We got lucky this time and I usually just buy two of it. I really like this one because it's not too sweet and um, I don't like the one with ginger in it and this one doesn't have ginger in it and they come with this um, sweet sauce. Sweet syrup, yeah. Yeah, sweet syrup and then you just add however much you like. So you're gonna take a little spoonful, right? Yep. And then put just it in. Just a little bit and just pour on top and then if I want more then I just add more and then yeah. I just eat. The hua is kind of like it's, it's basically kind of like a really soft tofu, but it's very light and airy. Mm -hmm. It's like you're eating a cloud. Eating a cloud. How's your dohua? Oh, yes, good. Mm. 
Can I try? Yes. Oh, today's one is like perfect. Well, it's probably because it's, it's made fresh this morning, so. Oh, it's really good. It's really good. My love. It's, it's like so light. It's, it's so light. So the thing that like oh, that just, separates this is like it's got like the taste of um, soy milk, but the texture of like a really of like almost like um, panna cotta, like a really really soft pudding. So and then if you just mix a little bit of sweetness with it, it's just like really light and kind of refreshing almost. Mm -hmm. It's a really nice uh, way to kind of start your day. Mm. And it and was freshly made and it was. It's warm. Yeah, and it's warm right now, so yes. that's it's really nice uh, when it is warm. You want another one? Okay, it's actually quite good. <laughs> mm -hmm. I didn't put a lot of syrup. Mm -hmm. If you want more, you can. It's nice. More. Really, really nice. She's going for the danta. Yeah. One of her favorites. <laughs> yes. It has like egg sauce on it. Yeah. Look at this. It's really crispy. So gold, you know. Very this beautiful is color like on crusty? it. Crusty? No, this is not. Flaky. It's very flaky. flaky. Oh yeah, flaky. Time to eat it. Mmm, <gasps> delicious. Mmm. Oh, really? So good. Because <laughs> it's so fresh. The next thing is this cha sao bao barbecue pork bun, that is super yummy as well. Um, you can get this either baked or steamed. Both taste really really good, so feel free to try it. Also, these curry beef bun, gali new rou bao, which is Alan's favorite. He usually gets it. So, which one's your favorite? Um, I like the zima chou today, and of course the dan ta, and then of course my tofu pudding. Your tofu, yeah. Yes, I love it. Me, I think um, <clears throat> you know, I really love the the sao mai. But I think my favorite is still the changfen. It's always been my favorite, and they just do it very so well here compared to every else we've tried in Chinatown. So. Yeah. So and also, um, there are two locations. Yeah. This Chu Chuan's Bakery in Chicago. One is in um, Evanston, mm -hmm. and then one is in Chicago's Chinatown. We haven't been to the one in Evanston, but if you are around the area, you can you know check yeah. them out. Yeah. The one in Chicago is also open earlier. So, the Chinatown. Uh, chi uh, yeah, Chinatown one. Um, 7 a.m. in the morning. I guess it's the Chinatown one, it's probably better because it's the original, but mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, but it's always busy, so you know yes. you know it's a good sign when they're always busy. Yes. So. yes. Yep, there's always a line, and also it's cash only, yep. just so you know, so come prepared. Even if you don't have cash, you can just, there's an ATM machine there, you can, you know. Um, get money out and pay them. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So. But always yeah. good rule of thumb to bring cash right. to Chinatown. In you always general. bring cash. Yeah. yeah. Correct. Yeah. And yeah. So I hope you enjoy this video. We really enjoy the food here. I really really like the food here. I always crave for it. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> you do? I mean, I like it. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I thought it's just me. If you ever say like, "Hey, let's go get Chu Chin," I'm like, "Okay." <laughs> yeah, we so. drive like. 20 yeah. minutes, about 20 minutes. No, 30, almost 25, 30 minutes. 25 to 30 minutes, yeah. Yeah, just to get this, yeah, because it's worth it. And then all of this costs about $30, right? Mm -hmm. $30, yeah. So, yeah. So if you guys enjoy this video, and if you try it, try this place and try other of their, you know, um, dessert. They have desserts, dim sums, uh, like cakes we never really tried yet. But yep. they also have bows, you know, you can freeze them. Yeah. I usually buy egg tart and freeze it and yeah. eat it whenever I feel like it. They also have uh, drinks and coffee. So a lot of people, they'll buy some bakery items and they'll get a cup of coffee in the morning. It's a nice place to kind of pop in to get a quick breakfast. Right. So if you want to go try it, go try it. And let me know in the comment down below if you like it. And or if you tasted anything that I haven't tasted here and you think it's worth trying, let me know in the comment down below. Yeah, so if you enjoy this video, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, give this place a go, you know, click the thumbs up button, subscribe. You can <laughs> and give us a like as yes. well. Yes, yep, I think thumbs up button. Yep. <laughs> yeah. And then click the notification bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. And yep, so we're gonna continue eating. I will see you next time. Bye bye. Bye, see ya.